My little brother was born with a very, very rare medical condition that no doctor even understood. So he can't sweat, and if the temperature gets really, really high, he'll get a seizure and then die. Egypt's a really, really hot country. So basically, my dad's faced with a life or death decision. Do I leave my family and save my son's life, or should I stay here where we've always been and we risk the chance of my son dying? My dad sold land that he had, and we flew out right away, right after. When we get to New York, it's very scary. We don't have a clue what to do. As an Egyptian who came here, you can drive a taxi, you can have a halal cart stand, or you can work at a restaurant. He went and picked a pizza restaurant. And for the next 15 years, I worked in a pizza shop to help my dad out. I was in ninth grade, it was just starting high school. I'm coming home and there's the fire truck and there's my mom outside with my brother. That whole apartment was completely gone. For the first time in our life, rent is actually free. So at that time, I didn't have to worry about just work and helping my dad, so I was gonna give school a shot again. I think in less than a year, I had caught up to where my high school was at that point. Okay, I've gotten myself this far, but I also just have no clue now. How do I get a job? What do I do? One friend of mine tells me, you know, there's this place in Long Island City that they're actually teaching you how to program for iOS and they'll help you get a job. They brought me in for an interview and then they called me the next day. They're like, don't worry, we're gonna cover your whole program. You don't have a laptop, we'll even take care of that part for you. And we start the program. Moya went through the program and he learned how to code. Met with amazing entrepreneurs. He interacted with other technologists from our community. And after graduating from the program, he decided he wanted to launch his own tech company. Today, my company is valued at $7 million. We have seven employees, and we're working on changing the way people work out in gyms. Once you do the exercise, you'll recognize which exercise you're doing. And when doing a proper rep, the angles will go green. He's literally gone from public housing to raising venture capital, right, and creating your company and employing others. We teach someone everything he or she needs to know to be able to successfully launch a career in, in technology. People who go through our program, on average, before they come in, make 18000 After they graduate, they make $85,000 a year working as software engineers and, and leaders in technology here in New York City. We're extraordinarily proud to be funded by Robinhood. They were one of the first organizations to back us, to believe in us. I was in the mentality of just pray that you can get a job in a place with an air condition. And that was the limit. That was the world. I think there's so many more people like Moya out there that would be able to do that if only given the opportunities to do so.